Yep, that's right. You can walk on it. So this is how they come packaged, rolled up in a box. I don't have the box anymore, but this is what it looks like. This is the 200 watt SIGS Yuma panel from Bouge RV. 360 degree flexibility and virtually indestructible. So this is the Bouge RV Yuma 200 watt SIGS thin film flexible solar panel and it has the mounting tape on it. There's a version with grommets. So this is definitely a sponsored video. We're thankful they sent it out to us. As you can see, I just walked on it several times. Virtually indestructible. It's SIGS technology. It does not contain glass. Super flexible. They, they say 360 degrees of flexibility. You can roll it all the way up. It can mount just about anywhere that you need. Not like your typical flexible solar panel, which is somewhat flexible, but not like this. Now we'll get into some of the more technical details of it in a minute. But for a full technical review, I recommend checking out Hobotech's video of him, and he will give you all the scientific stuff. I will put a link to that in the description. We are gonna mount this on top of our rooftop tent, and then I don't have a MPPT or PWM controller yet, but it's gonna feed into our lithium battery from Orion that we have in here. So it powers our fridge and other stuff. We can also, some point if we want just use the connector to go over to the teardrop so let's get it mounted and then we'll talk more about it in a little bit all right so we're up here we're gonna start i laid it out we're gonna it just covers the rooftop tent so the only here it'll go in here up there it's gotta go the one edge has to go onto this piece so it's pretty long 82 inches long and i believe 26 inches wide so we're going to peel off the backing and then just stick it on should be all there is to it i've cleaned the surface wiped down as much dust as possible is it my friends I could tell you right now that stuff is so sticky it is not coming off they say you can remove the panel just have to kind of get it started with a something very thin piece of metal and scrape so make sure you know where you want to put it and keep it there for a long time and then we're gonna run the wires coming down through here and we're done Okay, so I do not have a controller yet for our big battery, but to show you that it's already working, there's plenty of 
plenty of sun hitting them. <clears throat> it's a little bit at an angle, but the cables, the other nice thing is the cables are clearly labeled positive and negative. And so I've hooked it through there to a connector that we've got plugged in right here to our Blue Eddy, our portable Blue Eddy. Right here. And that's going to the panels. So this is already getting 80, 79 watts right now. Try to get where you can see it without the glare. So that's what's awesome. Um, it's not even in direct sun and we're getting a charge already. We can plug in this cable and charge our portable battery. We can take our alligator clips and charge our main battery. We just need a controller, um, charge controller. The portable Blue Eddies and stuff like that have charge controllers built in. So that's why you can just do it that way. But it's gonna be a great uh, upgrade to our system. We have the big 200 watt panels that are a suitcase, which we bring sometimes, but to be honest with you, unless we're going on a longer trip, I don't really bring them for the weekend because our power needs typically aren't that huge, but it is nice to have run more power and not really have to worry about anything. So, because we have a lot of camera gear and stuff that re needs to be recharged all the time, drones, and uh, biggest thing would be the refrigerator. I think would be nice to always not even have to worry about it. We don't have to plug it in anymore to a portable battery because we have our Orion lithium battery here in the bed, and now we have a way to keep it charged. I've been just charging it when we're back home. Uh, it'll usually last for the weekend trips, but this way now it'll be charged while we're on the road or out of camp constantly. These panels are really good. The technology, the SIGS technology is such that if there's shade over a little section, it'll still provide a really good output of power. Um, whereas typically if a panel is shaded, it really cuts the power down on the other kind. And the way the filaments are, if, it's, if just a few of the elements are blocked, it doesn't, or even if a couple of them get damaged, it doesn't take out the whole panel. So it's a really great technology. They are not cheap, I'm gonna tell you that right now, but you're paying for something that's gonna last. Ultra flexible, extremely thin, very durable. Um, I've watched a couple other guys who have really beat them up and tried to break them and they have not. So they are a really good option. And we will talk more about it in, out at camp. I'll thank you guys for watching. We're gonna have a discount code below. Um, check out Bouge RV, the website. They have a lot of, you can get this in a 100 watt version. This is the 200 watt version. Uh, you can buy them in combination packs and they give you a discount. We will have a link below for you guys to use if you wanna try them out. They'll also be linked on our Amazon page. So check it out. Gear reviews on Tuesday, trip videos on Thursday, and we will see you guys in the next one. Thanks for stopping by.